Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a brand new tutorial for you. Um, I'm excited because I'm starting this new series. Um, I'm going to be teaching you different club dance moves, all kinds of different styles of dance, because let's face it, if you go out to the club, there's going to be different music playing. So you're going to hear a little bit of top 40, a little bit of pop, dance, hip hop, dance hall, R&B, reggaeton. So it will be all here, different club dance moves, different styles. Mm, this way, I feel like you will be ready to go to any club and you'll be able to have fun with other people on the dance floor instead of just watching them. I'm going to include different difficulty levels. There will be actually four. So we're going to start with the basic um, beginner movements, intermediate and advanced. So I'm going to state which is which. Um, I will also group the movements into different playlists so it's easier for you to watch. They will be grouped by style and they will be grouped by difficulty level. If you like this type of videos, please give this video a thumbs up, like it, share it, subscribe to my channel, hit the notifications bell because I'll be posting videos every week um, and also stay tuned till the end of this video where I'm going to show you how to use this movement when you freestyle. Okay, let's jump into the first club dance move. Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out uh, What I want you to do is for now only move the feet We're going to take the right foot Turn the heel in a little bit And then come back to the middle Then we'll do the same thing with the left Bring the heel in And then back to the middle Notice that I'm not turning the heel all the way in we're not looking for the 90 degree angle. We're actually trying to make the movement as small as possible. So as long as the heel goes a little bit inside, this is what we're looking for. Let's try again. We have right, come back, left, come back. Right, come back, left, come back. A few more times. Mm -hmm. One more, right, and left. Then, what I want you to do is whenever the heel goes in, you're going to bend the knees a little bit. So we won't be doing the movement with straight legs because let's face it, this does not look like we're dancing. Uh, so every single time heel goes in, you're going to bend both knees just a little bit and then come up afterwards. So it's down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Good. Um, notice that the knee bend is small. We are changing levels. We are dropping a little bit, but I don't want you doing squats. <laughs> okay. So very little. Um, it's not just one knee moving. If you move just one knee, if you bend just one knee, your level won't change. So you'll still be standing upright. Okay. So we want both knees equally. Right and left. Right and left. So this way we have already a little bit of bouncing going on. The movement won't look very stiff. Okay, for now, we'll keep just the feet and knees. Um, Rhythm-wise, what we're going to do is we'll put the heel in motion on the snare drum. If you're not sure what the snare is, um, I did a video on the subject of rhythm, uh, so feel free to check it out. I'll post the link in the description box um, so you can watch it first so you understand what's going on. This video will be applied to pretty much every single tutorial that I'm doing, so I feel like it's a good one to check out. On the beat that sounds like a snap or a clap, that's usually what the snare sounds like, we're going to bring one heel in at a time. That's when, right? It just shows us when to move the foot. In, and in, in, and in. At the knee bend, once you have the footwork, just drop, and drop, and drop, and drop. Very good. Um, next thing we're going to add, just so the motion doesn't look um, stiff, we're going to twist the torso or actually twist the entire body, but just a little bit towards the foot, towards the heel that you're moving. So if I'm moving my right heel, I'm going to twist to the right, right? Then I come back to the center because we reset the feet and then twist the other way to the left foot. We have one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Nice and simple.
Okay, once we have the twist, last but not least, we have to do something about those arms. Since this is a basic movement, if I added the specific arm motion, it will be already four different things that you have to move at the same time. So I won't do it to you. We're going to just keep the arms slightly bent. Elbows are bent by your sides. And you can just keep them there as you're doing your little heel in with the knee bend, with the twist. Uh, one thing that you want to avoid doing this movement is mm, don't move both feet at the same time. Okay, so it's not this type of motion. It's always one center and then the other one. So it's a little bit more separated. One at a time. Let's try this move with music. Here we have the snare drum. And first, let's just start with the feet. One, two, one, two. Good. At the knee bend, once you have the rhythm. Once the lower body is working, twist. Okay guys, and now I'm going to show you how you can use this movement when you freestyle. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Please subscribe and all that stuff. Bye.